What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Carolina Styles, and I am back with another video, and I would like to finally introduce y'all to the new content of my channel. It is called Carolina Talks, and basically, it's going to be me and a couple of the people of my choosing or whoever want to get on the show and uh, well, on the podcast, video podcast, and uh, we're basically going to have deep conversations about a lot of stuff going on in the world today, uh, topics that I get on my social media platform, and my comment section so make sure y'all really get busy in the comment section and y'all tell me what y'all think about the new content i'll bring to the channel if i have 1 10 12 100 hundred thousand views on the on these carolina talks it doesn't matter because at the end of the day i'm still going to continue to keep doing them you know i'm a firm believer in god and i really do have a gift with motivating people and i just want to share my gift worldwide and i know this like you know, I can't change everybody, but a lot of the stuff I put on my social media, on my Facebook and stuff, it really motivates people. And people actually come up to me and tell me it motivates them. So I decided to share my talents with the world. I don't need to hide anything. So let's go ahead and get into the topic of today's video. Make sure y'all like, subscribe, turn that notification button on, come rock with the style game, get busy in the comment section. 2023, we going up. I have more content coming soon, and I have another truck video that's already ready, but we're going to drop this first. So let's get into today's video. All right, so the topic of today's video is going to be why men do and act the way we act and do. I'm going to give y'all a couple of my pointers, my opinions. If y'all feel like I'm wrong, I'm right, or whatever, I just want y'all to drop it in the comment section. Hit me up on my social media platforms. Just uh, give me a lot of feedback and some topics for the next videos. Basically, I'm just going to give y'all my opinions. I'm going to give y'all about three or four opinions. I'm going to back up each of my opinions. So let's and let's start from the young on up. A lot of a lot of men fail in this world and we act the way we act because we don't have a father figure in our lives. You know what I'm saying? We have men that don't take who makes babies but don't take care of them, leave them to the mother. We have men who want to be in the child's life but the baby mama won't let them because of x y and z which ladies y'all gotta stop doing that because no disrespect to y'all your boy your child needs a male figure in their life it's some things y'all can't teach us like we need the tools and the power and the guidance the knowledge to make it in this world especially a black african-american we need a father figure to help us tackle this world and don't get me wrong it's some males out here who live in wrong but I'm going to be honest, as a male, our children, period, but our boys to be better than us. So we're going to guide them in the right direction. We're going to give them knowledge that we wish we got when we was younger. I got great knowledge. I'm going to be honest with you. But I'm just saying from a male's point of view, we're going to teach our children better and want them to do better and put us in a better, put them in a better position than we was ever put in or to do. Is just the second one is we're going to have to learn to watch what we do and what we say around our children because they pick up on everything. Like saying if you in an abusive relationship with your significant other, your wife or the mother, your child, and you're out here beating on and stuff like that, what you think your son going to do? Are you out here Are you out here doing this, doing that, game banging, you know what I'm saying, robbing, killing, and your child look up to you? What you think your child going to follow? Your child going to follow your footsteps. No Man, want their child to be like them. They want their child to do better. When you, even when you look at the celebrities now, I'm just gonna name a few of them. What you think about Master P, Ice Cube, Dr. Dre, and all of them? They didn't want their child to be like them, having to grow up with the obstacles they grew up in. That's why they hustle as hard as they did to provide their children with a better life, and how they mold and groom their sons to do bigger and better things. Snoop Dogg kids pursue an athletic career. They he didn't want his kids to go out here banging. And doing what he did, not saying that, you know what I'm saying, everything he didn't, everything they did in life made them in the man they are today. But they want their children to have a better opportunity than what they did growing up so they can handle things differently. And that's basically what every man want to do. So, ladies, if your if your baby father wants to be in that man, be in your son's life or your children's life, let him be in it because he don't want his son to be a lost soul in his world. And another thing I want to say, and this is probably going to be the last thing that I actually hit on, is men are not loved correctly. We don't know. Sometimes we don't know what love is. And while I say that is because we don't have like some father figures doesn't teach their children how to love. They'd be like, don't trust nobody, this, that, and the third. Or they can fall in love in their first relationship and get done bad or something happened. They get their heart broken. That turns them into a savage, into a dog. Now I'm speaking for living proof. My first relationship ended bad. And 
it turned me into the wrong person for a long period of time. And don't and I'm a firm believer in God. When you do wrong, you're gonna catch karma. Like you're gonna get your payback. You know what I'm saying? It might not happen right then and there. It might happen a couple of years from now, a couple of months, a couple of days, but it's gonna come. You know what I'm saying? So I, I try to do right by any and everybody. Just know that it's coming. Karma will come. But it's a lot of reasons why sometimes we're not really taught. Sometimes we don't know how to. And that's why I say being having the right father figure in your life and plus the right parents in your life will help you with that. A lot of us men don't get love unless we got money. Society today teaches us you can't have a successful relationship unless you do X, Y, and Z, unless the man paying for this, that, and the third. The man got to pay all the bills. Y'all, like, society has really changed a lot of people's perspective on a lot of things. Like, honestly, as a male, we su- we supposed to be taught to provide for our women, treat our women with enough respect, treat them like the queens they are. We around here calling these girls bees and hoes and all of that, and that's not what that's not what we supposed to do. And a lot of people be like, "Oh, our ancestors used to cheat, but they just never got caught because it's not a social because of social media and this that, and the third. Yes, some people used to cheat. Honestly, it's like when it comes down to a male, we have our flaws and stuff like that. But another thing that we don't do is we don't know how to open up, and that's one of our biggest flaws is we are scared to open up we are taught not to show no fear show no emotion but in this world today that makes you a punk and that makes you soft it doesn't make you soft it makes you a real gentleman it makes you a man females be patient that guy gonna show you how he really feels about you a lot of us love y'all a lot of us are in love a lot of us you know what i'm saying want the finer things in life want to have kids want to be with one woman a lot of us guys want that we most a lot of us don't know how to express that. Some of us ain't gonna express it because we think it's soft and we not that type of person. And then a lot of us are scared to, you know, what I'm saying express express our feelings because we might they might don't feel the same way. But fellas, sometimes you gotta take a leap of faith and express yourself. So ladies, it's not that we don't care for y'all or we just trying to keep that tough demeanor. It's because. We wasn't taught how to express ourselves, and society makes it seem like you can't, if you're a male, you can't do it. That's wrong. You should be able to express yourselves and tell your significant other how you truly feel. It doesn't make you soft. It makes you a man. It makes you an honest man. If you want that girl, prove it to her. Show her. Show her physically, mentally, and emotionally, and you're never going to lose that person. You don't have to have money to keep anybody. Your love and affection should do it all. Of course, you got to have some type of money, but you ain't got to be balling and pay for everything. Sometimes we settle for things. We don't be like, oh, man, I ain't got to worry about this, that, and the third with her. This girl right here, she'll do whatever I want to do. This girl right here, she aggravating. She only want the best for you. So sometimes ladies just got to be patient with us because at the end of the day, we really just, we, some of us are really not taught how to love, right? And some of us think we are punks or wimps just to react and love the way we need to react and love. But that's just some of my opinions on how I feel about a lot of this, about men do and act the way they act. I can go on for hours about this, but I just wanted to hit y'all with like three to four of my opinions on why. I feel men do and say what they say. And you just got to be, I'm being honest, you know what I'm saying? Be patient, love your person, be patient with them. Treat your kids, watch what you teach your kids, watch what you let them see. And fellas, get in your child life, teach them right from wrong. Because I promise you, society will be a different place for us men. We got the power for our seeds. Let's teach it and use it so they can be better than us. I want my son to be better than me. When I have kids, that's what I want. I want to be better than me. And I'm going to put them in a better position to be better than me. But make sure y'all hit the comment section down below. Tell me what y'all think about my Carolina Talk, my first um, session, my first segment of the Carolina Talk channel. Make sure y'all like, share, subscribe, turn that notification up. Come rock with the Styles game. We got more people, more content coming soon.